Hi, I'm Mary Esther Penner. My husband Mark and I have been working to help provide a Bible to deaf communities in their own languages. We've been doing this for about 35 years, mostly in Asia and specifically in Japan. When people hear that Mark's a sign language Bible translation consultant, they go, wow, that's exciting. And it is, it is. He gets to see deaf people encounter the scriptures for the first time in their language. It comes alive to them. And then they look at me and they go, oh, Mary Esther, what do you do? And I try to describe it to them. And they go, well, what did you do today in your administrative tasks? And I said, well, you see these brochures? Today, I took these. I put them in these envelopes. And then I stick stamps on the envelopes. My friend yesterday, when I was telling her, they said, um, I thought missionaries did cool things. Yeah. It's really easy to compare. Because my job sometimes is not at all very exciting. In fact, sometimes I spend my afternoon not even at my desk. I'm sitting at the doctor with my son who's ill right now. And when we compare and say, I know I'm part of the body, but I wish I was that part. I want to do that. And comparing can lead to jealousy and selfish ambition. And James tells us that, wow, that leads to disorder and every vile practice. And we don't need more of that right now. So what do I do? What do I do? I'm encouraged to remember right here in the scripture it tells me we have one hope. Whether we're doing things that look really fantastic or whether we're sticking stamps on envelopes this afternoon. And there's one body. We're all part of that one body, one spirit. There's one Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God, one Father of all, who is over all, through all, and in all. That's what encourages me today.